Another day, another squash mallow. <laughs> um, I have quite a few <laughs> for being an adult. Um, but they're fun and Georgia plays with them now. So they're not like totally useless. Anyway, uh, we are home from church, did some, you know, things around the house, did some dishes, had some lunch, tried to put Georgia down for a nap because she was acting tired and she was clearly not. So now Dallin is in her bedroom with her. They're playing, hanging out while I get some knitting time since I did a little bit of chores around the house. I'm going to try to finish the toe of his sock because I'm really close. Um, I'm to the point on the toe where I'm decreasing every round until I get the chance to Kitchener. So I just have a few more rounds left and then I may cast on his second sock. So that's started and ready to go. And then I might switch back to my sock um, to try to stay ahead on that one. Um, depending, we'll see how I feel. But um, I think I only have like maybe 10 or so rounds left of the, uh, the foot on my sock. Not sure. Trying to work on socks during the day and the nighttime make that my, um, Magnolia Bloom time, if I can get some good chunk of time and not worry about Georgia messing with my mohair yarn because that can tangle really easily. Um, so yeah, working on socks right now, not quite sure what I'll do after I finish Dallin's first sock and cast on his second sock, if I'll just keep going on his second sock to try to catch up on that one, or if I'm just gonna lay that aside and try to get even more ahead on my cold winter night sock, I'm not sure, but I will enjoy some vlogmas and some knitting. Okay, sock toe done. And it matches the heel. <laughs> Whew, second time's a charm. So we had, did that sock. I am probably going to weave it in sometime, but I feel like knitting instead of weaving right now. So I am going to cast on my second sock really quick. Oh yeah, one of my long tail cast on. Here we go, making progress. It's hard to see because it's a shorty sock, but finished the cuff and the leg and I just started the heel. So ideally today I would finish the heel flap and that would get me right on track with where I wanted to be but I think this is a great place to stop Ooh, that big yawn um I'm ready to take a break I think I will play around with some polymer clay it sounds like Georgia just went down for a nap finally <laughs> she basically passed out <laughs> in my husband's arms so <laughs> so she's going to sleep hopefully and then, see, so yeah, I'm going to mess around with some polymer clay. I would love to make little, um, little dragon figurines for all my family for Christmas. And I know it's late, so they probably won't get it in time. But that is the plan. I've got two of my little dragons done. There's my one little yellow guy and little blue guy. So basically, because we like to play dandy as a family, this is gonna be a little spot you can put your die 20. So cute. Um, I'm not like 100% happy with them, so I'll probably put these in the fridge or freezer, let them cool down, make it a little bit easier to handle without warping the clay, just cause the heat of my hands is making the clay too soft to work with well, um, and try to like smooth out some of the edges and stuff. But I still, I think this is a pretty good base. I've got two more to make that I wanna make um, green and red because I've got my parents and then both of my brothers. Um, hopefully I can get them done. Georgia should be waking up from a nap any minute now and so we shall see if I can hopefully get these done at least the rough rough parts done now and then I can come back maybe later tonight after these cool down a little bit and then do the final touches and then throw them in the oven to bake. Are you excited to be FaceTiming? 